greatest of ease. But you've Sometimes, only had this time about a fortnight, haven't yeah. you? She's already doing quite a big routine, as you can see. Yeah. And Is that just jump... because she's an intelligent animal, or, or do oh, they actually yeah. like to do tricks like this in the wild? Well, first of all, she is a very intelligent animal. I think cleverer than a dolphin. She's picking tricks up far, far cleverer. Mm. We um, take perhaps two or three weeks to train a couple of tricks, and she picks it up in a day. No question. Is no the fact problem. that you've got a dolphin here and it's doing some of the tricks helpful? Yes, very. It's also it's a two-way thing, actually. Sometimes the dolphin is a nuisance because she gets jealous and pushes her out of the way and leads her into bad ways. Sometimes she shows her the beginning of a trick and then she copies it, like the, spit, like the twist like this. When, you, when we twist it around, she said, oh, I'm not. <laughs> when we twist... Was that something she was doing anyway and then no, you she, encouraged um, her to keep it on? No, she copied it entirely from Squeak. Really? But the one with the kiss is different altogether. They like putting their tongues out. They've got this enormous tongue, see? Yeah, massive. Comes right up. When she gave you a kiss, well, that's lovely. She loves that. And, of course, we encourage her and pet her. Yeah. And petting is probably as much um, to do with training as, it is, as the actual feeding of the fish. Mm. In fact, most of the time we pet her, otherwise she get full. Mm. She, and she likes being petted just as much as she likes the fish. Mm. Now, this one's only three months old, so it's surprisingly intelligent. No, 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 three years three old. Three years old? Yeah, three months three years it should be old. suckling on Oh, yes, that's right, of course. But it is very, very intelligent, isn't it? Oh, I think so. Is it more intelligent than the dolphin, do you think? I'm sure, yes, yeah, much really? more intelligent. So you wish you had it for a bit longer? Well, we're, we're lucky to have it at all. Four months is, uh, is a wonderful time to have an animal for training. Mm. And I think for the time, well, she's already doing a big show. She's carried the show while the dolphin isn't well. Yeah. And people absolutely think she's marvellous mm. because she looks so good and she is so clever. Mm. Well, uh, what about this trick with the ball, Reg? How did you encourage her to start going for something which obviously wasn't natural to her? Well, first of all, you, you have to get her to touch it and then you feed her. Mm. And when she finds that she gets a piece of fish, she plays. Again, it, all training is play. Mm. The animal at play. You have to get to know her, you encourage her, you pet her. Well, I never thought I'd live to see a killer whale shaking hand. How long has this one been with you, Reg? We've only had it just over a fortnight now. Really? She's learned all those tricks in that time? Yes, she's done tremendously well. Is that because she's got the dolphin to copy, or is it just because she basically likes doing tricks and it's natural to her? Well, I, I don't think it's... She's a very clever animal. I think cleverer than a dolphin. Mm -hmm. And um, it'll grow to about 25 feet, about 23, per, being a female. She agrees with you. Look, she's yeah, shaking you want, her head. Yeah, you think so? Will you grow that far? And will, will she you? stay in, in captivity all that time? Yes. <laughs> yes, well, yes, she's going on to Hong Kong, to Ocean Park, Hong Kong. And um, they've got an enormous pool. They're going to try and get a mate for her as well. Mm. So they'll have two, and then they hope to breed them. Mm. And you're training her in the meantime? Yeah. Well, something like, for example, this orange ball trick, how would you go about introducing that to her? Because obviously something that colour isn't natural to her. So where do you start? Sure. And how much company and help do you think she's been for Squeak after Squeak's bereavement? Oh, I think she saved Squeak's life. Really? No question. Squeak, after her mate died, went into a complete 
almost a coma. She just went round and round, took no notice. She didn't feed for five days. We had children swimming. We had people swimming with her night and day. And then suddenly we, we got her back with the whale. And she suddenly said, well, you know, perhaps the whale is second best. And she started doing her tricks and she started to eat. Yeah. And since then, she's form really again. fallen in love with, yeah. with her all over again. Yes. Yeah. I haven't found one yet. What did you have over having? Mm -hmm. See, that's all right. Now you go in, then she can come out. Yeah, see? Go on, go, go in now. Go on, jump in. <laughs> right. We lost our male dolphin about six days ago now, seven days exactly. And we were all terribly upset, but we weren't as upset as our squeak because she nearly died fretting for the other one. In fact, she's only been working properly one day. She didn't feed, she didn't want to know anybody, and we had swimmers in all the time. And then finally, we had her out the Susie Wong, the whale. And you can see the baby killer whale up there. She's just three years old. The time, she's after the Susie, and she really does enjoy her. Unfortunately, we can't work the two together at first, because we're worried about all the little toys that our squeak uses, like the hat and the football and the cricket ball. And if Susie... Here we go. Good morning, everybody. That was going to be a big one, but another high one this time. Nice to see so many here. We hope it's going to keep fine for the rest of your holidays. And give her a nice clap because she likes lots of applause. <laughs> Lovely. 28 pounds of fish yet. And now we're going to throw all the coins out. Right up to the back, the far end. You can bring back five, easy. Come on. She's got a habit of leaving one behind so she gets two pieces of fish. Ah, oh, we've got them all today. I'm very glad about that. She's behaving herself today, all right? Now lift them up nicely. Right up high. Jolly good. Oh, dear. I dropped one. I'm sorry. But I ended up better. Come on. Thank you. Jolly good. That's our sweet There we go now. We're going to have our jump over the hurdle. And as you should do, she probably won't jump over it. What's the matter? What's the matter? No, they're not after. We don't want to leave all the dolls who have got the television camera on. Come on, tell us what you can do over the hurdle. Come on, over the hurdle. You've got to jump over it. Don't make even noise. You've got nothing away. I'm sorry, you're right. Come on, here we go. Over the top. Oh, dear. You're just a character female, can't you? Always right from the center of the picture. Come on, oh, right, all right, you win. Go on, over your go. Come on, over the top. And don't you dare do it again. She said, I'm just going to see Susie Wong. This is what we call the dolphin training the trainer. Go on. Now, it's a new hurdle, so I don't know what's going to happen. Oh, that was a very titchy one. Let's have it a bit higher, please. And squeeze, a big one. Now we'll have a big one. Come on, right over. She's teasing us today. She knows the cameras are on us. That's a better one. Thank you. Yes, I can tell you about 28 pounds of fish yesterday. <laughs> there we are. Put that in your mouth, Rob, and off you go. Show the pool round the pool what you can do. Go on, round you go. Lift up. Lift up, please. Right up high. You'll get your flowers wet. Lift up, sweet. Come on now. Oh dear, do I have to do this, he says. Lift up. 
came a kiss from the whale. And she's got the biggest, the pinkest tongue you've ever seen. And it's also very, very nice. She's an awfully, no sliminess, a super tongue she has. Watch this. Come on, right up, love. A big kiss. Come on, that. Put it out. Oh, what about that? Do you want to see it again? He's going to kiss you later on. Huh? Come on. Come on, right up now. That's gorgeous. Very nice. Never been kissed by two worlds. I was kissed for one about 15 years ago. It was about three or four times as big as you, and it had an enormous touch. Right. What are we going to do now? We're going to have a little kiss now. A little dance. Off she goes. The dog. She's watching squeak. Come on. Round you go. That's right. There we go. The dog's really killer whale. Come on. You can do better than that. Up you come. Very better than that. Much better than that. Come on. Right the way around. And again. And again. Very good. How about that one?
Well, you did all the work, so you can get all the fish, I think. Now, come on, you can have a bit too. Now they're going to play football. I think she got that anyway. <laughs> 